So I'm going to show you how to deseed a lemon the proper way and we're going to start right now. So lemons have always been my thing. Even when my mother was pregnant with me, she craved lemons and that was probably because of me. I learned this specific technique when I was working at a restaurant that served oysters. We would prep the lemons this way and we would basically make them seedless and make them nice and neat and pretty to look at. And these lemon wedges are a perfect go-to when you wanna add these to sauces or pasta or your salads or just squeeze them onto some avocado or some other type of fruit or vegetable to keep them from browning and oxidizing. And this technique will allow you to have seedless lemons anytime you want in your fridge and they're gonna last you about two to three weeks. Whereas fresh lemon juice, freshly squeezed lemon juice will last you about two to three days. And if you want more tips and tricks and videos like these, more techniques or more ways to work with different kinds of ingredients, definitely subscribe to the channel. So without further ado, let's get into the kitchen and I'm gonna show you how to break down this lemon. All right, so here is our lemon. And the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna top and tail our lemon. So we're gonna cut the top off and we're gonna cut the bottom off. And then we're gonna stand our lemon up and we're gonna make one slice down the middle, turn it around and make a second slice. And essentially we're gonna have four wedges here. So right in the middle of each wedge, you're gonna have this pith right here where most of the seeds are. And we're gonna remove this and the way we do this is we're gonna angle our knife and just slice right through. And then there is our clean lemon wedge. And now we're gonna slice this in half. And this is basically gonna give us eight wedges for each lemon. And I'm gonna do the same thing with the second wedge. And sometimes when you remove the pith, you'll have a seed remaining. You just wanna scrape that out with the tip of your knife. And we'll slice that in two. And move on to the last wedge. Here I'm just angling my knife and slicing that pith away. And then there's our seed. And we'll just remove that. And here is our lemon, nice and cleaned, seedless, and divided into eight wedges. And then you can go ahead and put this into a Tupperware container. And I'll leave a link down below on where you can buy these specific containers. These are used pretty much universally within restaurant kitchens. And these lemon wedges will last you about two to three weeks in the fridge. So there you have it, really simple, really straightforward. And these lemon wedges come really in handy when you wanna add them to some tea or when you wanna add them to a glass of water. It can also be thinly sliced and added to salads for a really big burst of citrus flavor. And you can do this with any kind of citrus fruit. It doesn't just have to be lemons. You can do this with oranges or limes or grapefruits and even apples. You're just basically going to do the same thing by cutting it into four wedges and then removing the seeds like we did with the lemon. There's so many health benefits to lemons in general. It's a great source of vitamin C. It's an antioxidant. It helps freshen your breath. It helps improve digestion and it helps improve your skin quality. So I really hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you learned something. And if you want to improve your cooking overall, definitely subscribe to this channel. I'm gonna be coming out with a bunch of content very soon 
that's just geared towards the breakdown of certain vegetables, fruits, fish, or even meats and poultry. All right, so I'm out of here, but until next time, keep on cooking.